it's my very great pleasure to introduce Professor Claudius Thome from Innsbruck in Austria, who is uh, here for the first time this year as faculty at our MIS course. Very well, I'm a neurosurgeon from Austria and I have been working with Roger for many, many years. And it's the first time, as he said, that I'm able to, to take part in the course and be here as faculty. And I think the great idea about the course is that we have MIS techniques and we really teach them both theoretically and then here in the CAT lab so that people really can go back home and they have had this first obstacle that they are not willing to really take the chance in a patient when they don't know what they are doing. Here they can do it practically, they, they can see how this works and this makes it much easier to then introduce that novel technology back home. How is this course different from other courses that you've been to? Well, for one thing, there are more there are more discussions on techniques, and it's not based on, on on industry or certain beliefs. People have very different opinions about things, and I think that's good. So that so that so that people say not endoscopy is everything, or you have to do MIS for every case. It just you you learn how to decide on whether this may be better open, and what may be good in in, in MIS, and then you also find the find out what the obstacles are and what the problems are if you do it at home on your own. Because it's always easy if you see it in a course and somebody who is an expert shows you how to do it, it's very simple. Yes. But if you do it back home on your own, it's a completely it's totally different, different, different story. Totally and that, that's why I think that's important. And this course does a very good mixture of, of basic knowledge, indications and then deciding on how to do it practically. That's exactly what we're trying to do, you know, we we'll try to include as many discussions as possible. We always leave a 10 minute talk, 10 minute di discussion here for that yeah. purpose. And then obviously the cadaver portion is, and, and we, have real, we have surgical simulation as well, so that's really important. Yeah. Thank you. No, no. Thanks for being Very here. Very welcome.